presenting the school-based management of Buena Vista Cigarettes Elementary School in this new normal, school year 2020 to 2021. With an area of 5,000 square meters, Buena Vista Cigarettes Elementary School, to date, is a medium public elementary school in the district of Magdalena that offers SPED and elementary education from kindergarten to grade 6 that accessibly caters to every needs of the learners from 6 barangays in Magdalena. In conjunction with an enrollment of 1,002 pupils, BCES is headed by a Principal 1, 1 MT2, 2 MT1s, 1 SPET, 7 T3s, 8 T2s, 12 T1s, and 1 Administrative Officer. With a total of 33 nationally funded teaching and non-teaching personnel, plus two job orders of security personnel funded by MOOE, one security guard, and one utility worker. BCES is currently in SBM Level 2 while practicing Level 3 by implementing continuous improvement programs to sustain and support the major concerns of the school. This aims to give solutions and procedures to address the learning gaps effectively and efficiently. The enrollment of BCES for the last three school years. This one shows the health and nutritional status of BCES for the school year 2019 to 2020. And this one shows the availability of books by grade level and availability of books by subject. And here shows the number of teachers based on highest educational attainment. And in here shows the sources of school funding. And in this slide, contains the dropout rate of BCES. And we're proud that the school attained zero dropout rate in two consecutive years. This slide talks about the promotion rate of three consecutive school years. In here, you can find the Phil Erie GST, English and Filipino pretest, wherein grade 6 have the highest percentage of learners passing the GST. This one shows the learner-teacher ratio per grade level, wherein the grade 1 has the highest teacher ratio, which is 1 is to 42. This one is for the learner-classroom ratio, wherein the school is lacking 7 classrooms as of school year 2019 to 2020. Here, you can see the learner-toilet ratio, which is 6 to 7 students to 1, lacking of 5 toilets for the whole school. Next is about the learner-seat ratio, which is 0 0.66 is to 1, lacking a total of 342 seats for the whole school year of 2019 to 2020. And this slide talks about the participation rate that increased with a percentage of 13.24 in a span of just one school year. And this one is about the retention rate. Well, this slide talks about the transition rate. And this one explains the cohort survival rate. This slide is about the dropout rate, and this one is for the repetition rate, and this one talks about the graduation rate, and so on and so forth. And to quote our dear principal, Dr. Rosely S. Tamina, every school has unique personality comprising its strengths and challenges that serve as spices in its endeavor to raise the bar of school performances in both curricular and co-curricular activities for the holistic development of its 21st century learners. And the following are the school projects pioneered by our former principal, Mrs. Severa Siversola, and now continued by our current principal, Dr. Rosely S. Tamina. Let's make some history tonight The child inside is wild Let's make this moment come to life The time is on our side Don't know what's up ahead It's only high and low Picture it in your head Nothing's impossible
if we fall and make mistakes We live, we learn, we change Gotta keep on going every day And it will be worth the 